Mastercard Mastercard Canada checking out Selfie Pay coming to Canada uh, sometime this summer. So here is how the experience unfolds. So take us through the app. Okay, so I've just made a purchase online. I've hit submit, and now my phone is alerting me that I have a pending transaction and they want me to verify my identity. I'm making a purchase at this retailer in that amount, so I acknowledge the alert. Identity check opens. It's asking me to tap to verify this transaction, so I do that, and now it's gonna ask me for a selfie. And it's approved, so now the order is complete. So I've just I verified my identity using facial recognition. And what does it ask you to blink? It's asking me to blink. That's actually a sophisticated liveness detection capability. So it's making sure I'm not trying to spoof the system, that I'm actually there, present, in front of the camera, that I'm not holding up a picture or anything like that. And what does this show here? So this is actually just some uh, transaction history here. So I, I, I've approved the following transactions. This one I was a little concerned with. It didn't know what it was. I declined it. So this app actually has the capability to decline a transaction as well. So imagine getting alerted for something that you didn't buy. You could put a stop to it before they complete the purchase. And that's uh, another powerful mechanism in the system. And that's a notification that comes straight to your phone? Yeah. So I can show that example here. So let's say same alert, right? And I was like, wow, that wasn't me. I'm not doing this. I want to stop, put a stop to it. So I can just hold this button here and cancel it. And now it's going to tell me that it's canceled and then I can contact my bank and then when I'm done, I'm done. That's it. Amazing. And now you can see I've declined a transaction. Interesting. So what do you think the adoption will be like and when do you think people will reach a point where this is more comfortable than either a fingerprint or simply just swiping well so we offer choice right so on day one when this becomes available we're, we're piloting it now we've announced the pilot with BMO today when it becomes available this summertime as well we'll have both of these capabilities available there'll also always be a fallback to a one-time code or another mechanism to make sure we can always complete the purchase but these are two methods that we've tested thoroughly and we're already seeing strong demand from consumers the fingerprint they've gotten used to if they have an iPhone 6 or an Android Android device that supports it. A lot of people are taking selfies so they can choose an option that works best for them. That's great. Thank, thank you so much. Looking forward to trying it out. You'll find more information on mobilesyrup.com.